AO Lithium sent me a battery, 100 amp hours. Oh, it's actually not that heavy. It's a 100 amp hour car sized battery. And it has Bluetooth 5.0. It's a uh, LiPo 4, obviously, 12 volt, 100 amp hour 4S. I don't know what the 4S means. Bluetooth 5.0. And it's got apps for uh, the Google Play Store and the Apple Play Store. And it's got an FCC ID on the front of it. I'm going to put it on the West Mountain Radio thing right now. Ham Radio 2.0 reviews, news, and how-tos of things that are new in ham radio, but I love these battery tests. So let me put this on the meter, and then we'll pull up the West Mountain Radio software. All right, so I've got the West Mountain Radio software plugged in to my CBA5 and got this test open up. Just the same way we do all these other battery tests, I'm going to charge it at one amp an hour to see if it lasts 100 hours, which is what it's advertised at. I did notice that the, the top of the battery has a red post and a blue post. The, the negative terminal is blue instead of black. I don't know. Strange, but okay. All right, let's click on detect here. It detects 13.4 volts. Capacity, it doesn't detect. I always set that myself. And cells is number four. Uh, the weight and the age uh, is something that I set for a previous battery that it does not apply today because the only thing it really detects is the voltage. That's really the only thing it detects. So it, this comes in at 13.4. Charged this last night. I know it's uh, topped off, so we're going to get a good charge on it. So I'm going to click start right here. And it's going to start right there at 13.4. Actually, it's, yeah, 13.4. It's sitting there at about 13.3. And we're going to let that go. It's going to take about four days, but that's okay. Oh, hopefully it'll take four days. It's 100 amp hours. That's 96 hours is four days. So hopefully this will go for about four days. I'll see you in four days. That test ran, and I've got the results that I'm going to show you here in just a second. But right now I'm going to install the Bluetooth app by scanning that code. We'll install that. AO Lithium is the name of the app. It's got that yellow icon, or kind of, yeah, yellowish orange icon right there. Okay, open. Uh, sure, it makes you accept something. Allow, allow. Okay, while using the app, searching device list. There we go. Okay, there's my battery right there. I assume that's my battery. It's the only AO Lithium battery that I have. So connecting to that, 100%. And guess what? After I ran this test, I charged the battery back up the next day, and it's been sitting for about a week since I've charged the battery back up. So the fact that it's 100% after sitting for a week is very good. You can see right here, the current voltage is 13.34 volts. Good. Current, uh, the current current, <laughs> the at the time of this recording current in and out of the battery is zero because I don't have anything plugged into it right now. That's the temperature. That's the power. Cycles, it's been charged down and up one time. I like it when these apps show cycles about how many, how much life you have left in your battery, basically. And then uh, average voltage there. Normal capacity is 98.16 amp hours. And residual capacity is 98.15 amp hours. So according to this, the normal capacity is 98.16 amp hours. It's not truly 100 amp hours, which is okay because according to this test complete I got right here, this battery actually came in rated at 98.685 amp hours. Measured watt hours is uh, 1,281.72. That shows as a 98.7% efficiency. However, however, if according to this app, the normal capacity is actually 98.1 or 1.6 or 1.5, and it's reading at 98.685. It's actually higher capacity. It's saying 98.7% capacity because I told the CBA5 software that it was a 100 amp hour battery. So it's actually kind of rated at 98 amp hours, 98.1, and it's coming in at 98.6, so it should be actually over capacity. So if I was run to test again, it'd probably come in at like 100.5 or 100 and 1% efficiency, something like that. But after all of that, I think it comes in really well, and I would like to know what you think about the battery.